bittersweet start to the week on Staten Island as a new ferry joined the fleet. It displays the name of a hero from the island who died serving his country. Family, friends and officials gathered to watch the commissioning. CBS 2's Vanessa Murdoch has the story. The christening and commissioning of the Staff Sergeant Michael H. Allis summoned a big crowd Monday, understandably so. This ferry is named for a Staten Island hero. Michael H. Allis enlisted in the Army at 17 years old. After graduating from high school, he went on to serve for seven years. In August of 2013, though, while on his second tour of duty in Afghanistan, he died, shielding a Polish soldier from a suicide bomber. He was a ranger. You go, you go toward a fight. You don't run from the fight. Bob Allis, Michael's father, says the commissioning of this ferry means his son's name will roll on forever. Because I think he deserves it. This plaque will be secured inside the vessel, giving every passenger from near and far the opportunity to learn more about him. Over millennia, we've trained to survive to do that, to get away. And yet, Michael chose to go against human nature. What seems to be an era of selfishness. Mike Allis is a radiant example of selfless service. The ultimate hero, according to Mayor de Blasio. Michael brought great honor to his family, to this borough, to this city, to this nation. This shiny new ferry with a top deck walking loop and charging stations honors him in return. It's world class, it's top of the line, it is worthy of him. We waited for several years for this, but finally it's here, so we're thrilled and, and we're sad, you know, at the same time. Sad their beloved son no longer stands beside them in the flesh, but thrills his story and his sacrifice will not be forgotten. From the Staten Island Ferry Terminal on Staten Island, Vanessa Murdoch, CBS 2 News. Mm, befitting yeah. a hero. Yeah, we will honor him. Forever.